We're going to be palpating the muscle vastus intermedius. I'm going to be starting on the distal attachment or insertion of vastus intermedius. So just like the other quadriceps, it is attaching to the patella, the base of the patella, or that more proximal and superior part of it, and then to the tibial tuberosity down in this area here. Again, through the patellar ligament or the full quadriceps tendon, depending on your reference for that. Vastus intermedius is actually deep to rectus femoris, originating all the way along the anterior surface of the shaft of the femur. So one of the kind of ideas for palpation is if I was grasping the more superficial muscle tissue like this and asking her to lock her knee, good, this would be me grabbing rectus femoris. But if I wanted to get at vastus intermedius, which is deep to this, rectus femoris doesn't actually have an attachment to the femur. So in theory, what I wanna do is go on an edge push rec fem out of the way and try to get my fingertips deeper onto the bone underneath it. So again, they are gonna be fascially bound together. This is not as simple as I'm describing, but you're trying to move the muscle on top over and trying to get to the deeper structure underneath. The other way to think about this is if you're pushing through rec fem through the first layer, you're gonna get on the second layer, which is vastus intermedius. Now I'm gonna lay my forearm on the thigh. Just to give you an idea, the femur does not go straight up through the center of the thigh. It actually looks a little bit more like this. So the bone actually goes more lateral and then the head of the femur is facing into the acetabulum. So as you palpate up the shaft, please make sure you're following it a little bit more lateral instead of going straight up the middle. There's a lot of muscle tissue on the inner thigh and the adductors, but you can actually follow the shaft of the femur up and a little bit more lateral. So deep all the way along the anterior surface of the femur is going to be the origin of vastus intermedius. Basically everything from the intertrochanteric line all the way down just to above the patellar surface. This is all the origin of fastest intermedius, and then again, inserts into the patella and tibial tuberosity. That's gonna conclude our palpation of fastest intermedius.